This video is inspired by DB Grinders uh, game where two opponents, cash tier player and rescue case players are playing for uh, $260. So uh, uh, pretty good players because they are at finals. Um, and then they are playing for something good, which is 260. They, they're just not playing for fun or like just DB ranking. So I would ex I expected cash tier to player to play perfectly. Uh, however, I see there's a definitely an improvement in this play, so I'm gonna show what I would have done. So let's first watch uh, what uh, how the game goes. So I'm gonna explain until here. So a rush case player went first, got one ashed in the on the uh, the sinful one for one. And the rescue case player has zero cards in their hand, but they have set four, which are rescue emergency and two traps, Baron and the uh, turbulence hydrant and the random Selene that they decide to keep. And then uh, in the graveyard, there's a preventer and in the banished part, there is a hydrant and an airlifter. So they can rescue their uh, preventer uh, to... Uh, get the get the preventer set up to book one of the cash names and then they can uh, sack the preventer with the emergency to uh, bring the airlifter for their follow-up so i set this up where rescue case has same exact scenario uh cash zero and pretty much the same thing and uh the cash right, zero is just a link three that i'll be able to make actually has a has a home. uh Triple yeah, tag, which I don't have in my hand right now, but uh, they, uh, the Baron ends up negating it. Oh, my bad. Uh, sorry, I have to explain it again. So what exactly steal happened effect, was right? you steal Baron. What exactly happened was uh, so they they booked the uh, unicorn on summon and then. They may immediately went to search the feather duster, and then they just decide to immediately activate it and get Baron negated. So, uh, and then they triple tech to draw two cards, but then draw two doesn't really solve any solve anything because you have to deal with the two traps. And obviously, you're not gonna like draw into twin twister or anything crazy for the back row. So. Uh, they just do it uh, where you can just simply activate triple tech. They have to bear in there and then you can heartbeat their back row. So I'm going to assume they did that and see what you can do from there when you just have Theosis and Rise Art. So uh, triple techs negated. Baron already used the negate. The triple thrust will be activated and then you search the heartbeat's feather duster and then you'll activate the Feather Duster. Oh my bad. So uh, this game state is a little different. Um, so they uh, re so they uh, reborn the Preventer, and then uh, that happened when Unicorn was summoned, and so Unicorn is face down right now. And uh, even though Rescue Case player could just deal Unicorn with the trap. In, uh, to play around the triple tag, which is pretty basic and stand standard in my opinion, they decide to just do this. So they that's why they got triple tagged and triple thrusted in the first place. Uh, okay, anyways, you heartbeat their back row. Uh, the rush case players has has a one quick quick effect quick play, uh, which is an emergency. They will activate uh, simply just to bring out anything. Uh, anything and then tribute it. So I'll just tribute the uh, preventer and then that'll bring out the rescue, uh, sorry, uh, airlifter from the banished pile. And then the airlifter would be able to search the hydrant. My bad, the uh, HQ. So they have HQ in their hand. And then, so like they have so many monsters, if they have like two or three, that's a threat then you can definitely just try to aim for the uh, two pops of the dark armed and the uh two pop one pop of the draco sec and possibly the typhon bounce like on cards like baron and then make utopic future with uh, those two card uh the draco sec and the 
dark harm. So then you can either just end on that, or because you're make, uh, making Typhon, I guess, not ideal. So like you can just not make Typhon and make former Terra Zeus. But because there are way too many monsters, you definitely would want out everything by just Zeus before you commit to play. So people say like Rizar is not amazing. Some people play two and they say like you side out Rizar going second or you just play two Theosis or some people just say you play three Theosis just because they want to play part of this urge in the main deck, which is crazy to me because like you, you should like be thankful about having these two as your last as your last card when you're playing Kaftira. Cause like if you have Fenno here, like it, it just cannot even hit the board. So like this card is as important as your Fenno uh unicorn. Anyways, um so from here you will normal summon the Rhysar, activate Theosis, that's like your only play. But thankfully you know for sure that opponent has a zero interruption. Your only only option here is Unicorn because Unicorn can search the birth. Searching Fenro would not do much. And then declare the Rise Art effect uh, that'll banish a Fenro. And then uh, you can make the Ausnar Falcon. So like if this is his soul, like you're it's not like you're losing you're lost the duel, like because there's no line for it. Uh, but here you can bring out the Zephyros and then you just go battle um, and then uh, you can the, the whole point is like this uh, Falcon must uh, um, just battle your XC battle basic, basically so you would just kill the Selene because Selene you can just do some damage uh, so opponent will take some damage and then uh just set, just nothing else matters so you go to uh, main phase two and then uh summon up the zeus now you're just gonna activate zeus so so people are wondering from here like what can kestra do uh, and it's also because Rescue Ace would have a top deck, which is actually like not that crazy mo most of the time because in their deck there's like no good cards. It's like it just has to be like hand traps. Like they cannot top deck cards like Airlifter, uh, and they they went they also went through like two Preventer to Turbulence uh, while making their uh, first place. So like in here. They have all the good names, basically, and then all the spells, uh, and then they have Hydrant Banished, so, like, 200, and if you're, you're also, like, out of Hydrant if you play just one, I mean, just two, some people play third right now, but yeah, so, like, res Rescue Ace cannot top that good card, uh, only threat is this can search the Hydrant if they play the third, and then this can give them a draw, which also, like, your draw wouldn't matter unless they, like, HQ to... Uh, be able to return all the good cards, but I'll, I'll get to that point later why that doesn't really matter So from here uh, Kestra can activate birth and then summon out the Fenro. That's the Monster that you did not use the effect. So declare the Fenro effect uh, that'll search the uh, rise heart Because you control the rise heart, the Fenro rise heart can just special summon and then Zephyros can uh, special summon by bouncing the birth. And then just reactivate the birth because you will be um, you will be uh, using this birth effect to play to make rescue Ace cards banished. So they will all become defense and then uh, you can make Typhon. So unless they out the Typhon, they cannot resolve the the turbulence again so uh, rescue ace uh, player will get their turn uh, draw and then I will just reveal what they drew and then it was entirely random so see they, they it is it is a really good draw for them because this card is a very few card that does anything it could be any hand trap 
but still it's like not as impactful as uh draw airlifter because uh, because that card is at one now so uh rest case opponent has the hq let's say let's say they uh hq first tier then just by activating it they, they it'll trigger the birth and that will be able to banish like both of the turbulences and uh one of the trap or like even uh so this card must return the uh the abel started oh to the deck and then uh this card must return uh, this card to draw so if if they ever banish this card they are losing two resources but definitely so they will like banish two tur plus that and like they, it's gg because this uh their top deck is not doing anything they cannot even draw so this is not an option for them so uh they can start with uh searching the hydrant and if they do it um they will lose the the one it draw and then they will also still lose uh, the turb two turb turbulences so like what would hydrant search from their deck like they just have impulse so I'm so and then it's more riskier to just blind try to draw with the wanted and uh, that'll return this so that'll like not make you search the high the third hydrant so like that's not an option so even without Baguska and the Typhon they just lose the game because of you ended on Fenno birth unless they draw like. Hard piece feather duster, which which is impossible because this was a game on a scenario. Okay, this is it for now. Thank you guys. I'll um I'll see you guys next time with more cash tier content.